All right, so boom, we back in Hold My Nugget Studios. I was recently tipped off of this battle between this human Cyberman versus his opponent, Frankenstein in the face. Upon further speculation, these two don't look like they're around the same size. Wait a minute! What kind of competition is this? It's Andre the Giant versus Hornswoggle. Who sanctioned this? That looked like the colossal titan taking on one of Snow White's dwarves. I ain't gonna hold you, though. Looks like the little man might possibly have a chance because the giant doesn't look very athletic. You saying you want a piece of me? Do something, you little bitch. Is this a fight or an uncoordinated step dance competition? What the hell they doing in there? Nobody's connected on a single blow, and the little man is taunting the giant. Might I add, what size shoe you think that big dude wear? They probably gotta create his sneakers on his feet. That's it. Enough of this shit. Ah! Oh, How dare you? He's just a little boy. How oh, can you stop? I'll get his up! I'll get his up! I'll get his up! Wait a minute! How you gonna get pimp slapped in the midst of battle? Come here! I did it! Oh, what are you gonna do now, big boy? Come back here, you little son of a bitch! I'll fucking do it again! Okay. Why are you gay? Why are you running? Why are you running? I We've covered a lot of weird fights on this channel, but I am perplexed, flummoxed, and flabbergasted from what I'm watching right now. Where do you think you're going? Police! Help! Round two, fight! Fuck out of here! Come at me, bro! I got you now, SpongeBob! No! No! Finish him! <laughs> My leg! But why little man try to plead with the referee like that was illegal? You can't be crawling through a big man's legs and think he ain't fixing to throw you. He should have tombstoned his little ass when he had the chance. Now he getting leg kicked in knees that don't look stable. Gotcha, bitch. Oh, God! Ah! Ow! <laughs> What's the matter? You're the one who started this game. And now you don't want to play anymore? You were enjoying yourself before. It was all fun and games until he got flipped. He begging the referee for a timeout, but this ain't a video game, stupid. You going on a t-shirt tonight. You better have insurance. Shut up, bitch. I don't give a fuck. Big man ain't playing games. He slapped the last three remaining hair follicles off his head. Hiya! I'll fucking do it again. Okay. Hiya! Second round was not good for the little man. Homie got flipped, tossed, and turned. You would have thought he was an escort on Valentine's Day. The simp chivalrous giant did everything in his power to avenge the honor of the ring girl after she was followed at the conclusion of round two. Police! Help! Tell me I did not just see that. That's a woman in the ring, damn it! I don't give a fuck. You son of a bitch, don't What's you hit her? Don't you hit her? Discipline. -uh, don't discipline. But soon he will learn manners. I will torture his body so that his soul learns to be humble. When I squeeze your lungs and you beg me for life, then your heart will open up to the Lord. Wait, what did he say again? That doesn't even make sense, really. When you eat through plastic too, when you are paralyzed from neck down, then your family will gather around your hospital bed. To see the new day. And now a word from our sponsors. It's March, and I want to see you marching towards some rewards with Fetch. Fetch Rewards is a super easy to use free app where you can earn free rewards on literally anything that you buy. Scan any receipt or e-receipt and you'll earn points no matter where you shop or what you buy. But keep in mind, as always, receipts can't be older than two weeks, so make sure you scan those receipts immediately. The reason why I use Fetch is because of their speed, they're extremely easy to use, their reward options, and I can get points from literally anywhere. From any retail store, all Amazon purchases, darn near every single one of my e-receipts, and all of of the restaurants possible. So click the links in my description. There should be no delay. Download the Fetch app today. Use promo code Chiseled. You'll receive 3,000 points when you scan your very first receipt. That's promo code Chiseled. Receive 3,000 points when you scan your very first receipt today. The Fetch way. And now back to your regularly scheduled program. Final round. Fight. Come here. Finish him. Big man ain't playing games no more. My hand! He thought it was sweet. He could just slap the booty cheeks of ring girls like the big man ain't come from a family of gentlemen. <laughs> now look at him. Pelvis on the ground. Weak in the knees. Can't even keep his footing. It's up to you. Do you want to continue or not? 
man's got hit with the strength of an earthquake, and now he's feeling the effects of the aftershock. What happened? I don't know! Are you okay? Honey, are you okay? I don't even know where the hell I am. This man is dead. Who knew Ric Flair transmogrified into a balding Hispanic? And I will never retire! I've got you in my sights. Whatever contract they initially agreed upon, it went out of the window the moment little man decided to touch the booty of the ring girl. Come here. You gotta give kudos to Hispanic Krillin. He's not running away from the smoke, but he's barking up the wrong tree. Now for the finishing move. Finish him. I broke my back. Your my back is broken. Spinal. Where the ambulance? Why the man body still right there? Ain't supposed to be Call there. the damn ambulance! Oh yeah! Look at you! You was popping all that good shit a second ago! You eat a dick! You thought it was sweet! Now look at you! Laying on the ground! Looking like a bitch! Cause you got slammed from the east! To the west! Back to the east! Back to the west! If I was that uncoordinated Frankenstein, I would have dropped a Hulk Hogan leg drop on your larynx. In fact, it's not too late. He's in range. Do it. Just do it. I'll snap his neck. Break his neck. He waking up tomorrow with kyphosis, scoliosis, lumbar lordosis, and lumbar stenosis. His spine is going to be shaped like Shenron. Now you got to go home to the homies and explain how you stepped in the ring and got your back blown out. He going to need conversion therapy and a Sinzu beam. At this point, even the Pokemon Center can't save him. Just let him die and put your trust in the spell card monster reborn. He don't need a medic. Somebody please roll him into an unmarked grave during the winter time so his body can freeze. Snake, are you okay? Snake? Snake? And welcome to your first day in the afterlife. Do it! Just do it! Make your dreams come true!